Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for Monday, January 29th. Okay, this is for all signs, and this is this may not resonate with you, but it may. Let's see what does. This is for all signs. I just feel like it's really important to shuffle on the camera so just bear with me because it, it is it just is I want to make sure that you guys see the messages that I didn't hand pick them okay I didn't hand pick your messages well I just did that one but you know what I mean this is gonna be here conflict in defeat many of you maybe feel like running away from something maybe you are actually running away from something um, this is the five of swords so it feels like there's some power struggles here and you may just be feeling like you want to get you want to get the hell out of here I want out out these are also mental conflicts okay so keep that in mind Maybe you just need to release something. We're not going to do reversals for the daily vibes. This right here is the Ace of uh, Pentacles. So, you know, this is a time of receiving. You should be receiving something, maybe on a tangible level, probably on a tangible level. This could be a gift from somebody. It could be money. It could be a new partner. Either way, it's a new opportunity for security, stability, abundance, and prosperity okay so when you when you get this card it means that you are going to you're being offered a gift okay so that's great maybe it's an offer for you to release something I don't know let's get some more cards we're gonna use another deck now prosperity begins Woo! that's a really great card to have it's a gift from God. When the ace of when any ace comes out, it's a gift from above. It's about manifestation. Okay, now I remember I told you this was mental. Your thoughts become things. Keep that in mind. Okay, because you have the power to manifest positive things in your life. You have the power to manifest prosperity. Okay? That's what that says. I'm going to do this one right here. Oh my gosh, this looks really good. Ooh, this is great. So yeah, what I see going on here is you guys are moving away from something. You are, you're letting something go and that's when your prosperity begins. We have the Ten of Swords here. So what that tells me is that you, you've been defeated in some way or you felt betrayed, but that's no more. It's over. It's over. Now you're letting go. You're starting your new phase. You're going through your transformation. You know, the past is the past. I'm letting this go. This needed to end. I feel like you guys are letting something go that was very, very, very heavy where you felt this enormous loss and now it's time to heal. Your hope is coming back. You're starting to feel inspired again. And when you do that, that's when you start to receive the gifts that you deserve because you're letting yourself receive them. Okay, I feel like this is a time of wish fulfillment. Finally, after a difficult time where you, you know, you have to let something go. I feel like there was some kind of split where or mental conflict that you were holding on to that now you realize it's no need. I don't need to hang on to this anymore. It's really time for me to bring my my self back to where I need to be. It's time for me to bring my security back. That's what I see. There's a new beginning here with the death card. When the death card comes up in a reading, it means that you're releasing something, and that's what I see. You guys are releasing something. It's, something has come to a head. It's over, and now it's time for me to go after my dreams. Okay, it's, 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 it's a time to chase your dreams, and that's what you're doing. It's a realization that it's about to come true, okay? Now we're going to get one of these. 
transformation is on the horizon for many, many, many of you. And it's because of some difficulty, some loss, some disappointment that has opened your eyes. And now your, your renewal is going to bring you what you've been wishing for. Okay? Your, your positive thinking, your manifestation your desires you know are coming to fruition because you are letting go of something that didn't serve you all right that's what i see with the death card the ten of swords and the star many of you are letting go of something and because you let go you really really let go your your prosperity does begin let me zoom this in for you So yeah, there's been some kind of conflict in the past that you're letting go of finally. You're stepping out of it. I'm done. I, I'm not doing this anymore. I'm moving forward. I am. It's over. I've hit my rock bottom. It's time to go up. So you're moving on up and you're moving on up pretty quickly. Because now, instead of feeling stuck in that situation where your mental conflicts were holding you back, you're not doing that. It's like you're leaving them behind. You're leaving these this mental drama behind you and because you're doing that it is a time of hope it's like you have the, you're having this renewed inspiration to go after your dreams and when you do that when you really replace the negative with positive because over here we have negative and over here we have positive that's exactly what's happening we have negative that transforms into positive and so that is what is going on it's like you're letting go of this negative self-talk and because you do that your dreams start to come into fruition it's like your your hopes and your wishes and your desires are starting to become more real you're seeing the truth and the fact of the matter is is when you become positive that's when your ultimate prosperity really does begin okay many of you are totally saying goodbye to the past and walking down a new road we're going to read this card dream talk your subconscious constantly and sub and subtly subtly speaks through your dreams it's just one of the many ways in which your soul and those here in the spirit world can reach out and communicate with you through signs symbols messages and more this card says that your dreams are telling you something okay whether they're daydreams or night dreams really really pay attention to your dreams because that's what's manifesting okay even in the in the subconscious okay your dreams are your subconscious trying to tell you something all right so really seriously your dreams are telling you something you're probably having vivid dreams at this time about your your future about your dreams about your your life dreams okay you're having dreams about your future desires and I see that you are being called to really listen and to manifest what you want okay this is the time this is the time of your transformation release the past really really release it it's over it's done you can only go up from here and it's a time of inspiration and renewal okay really really look at this as you are headed towards your hopes and wishes being fulfilled because it's being offered to you. You are being offered the opportunity right now to grow and manifest your heart's desire. All you have to do is not look back. Don't look back. It's over. That's over. And your dreams are giving you the answers. Daydreams, night dreams. Really pay attention to your thoughts at this time and what you can recall of your dreams because they have a message for you. So this is your daily reading for Monday, January 29th, 2018. Talk to you later.